and outline for the doctrine of birth in the pure land by monk genku according to the teaching of our jodo school the teachings of buddha shakyamuni are divided into two categories namely the holy gate and the pure land gate all buddhist teachings of mahayana buddhism and hinayana buddhism from the flower garland sutra and the agama sutras taught in the early period to the later period lotus sutra and nirvana sutra which teach the path for the realization of enlightenment by eradicating illusions in this delusive world of anguish are called the holy gate regarding the holy gate there is the holy gate of mahayana buddhism and the holy gate of hinayana buddhism Within the holy gate of Mahayana Buddhism, there is also the Buddha vehicle and the Bodhisattva vehicle. Within Hinayana Buddhism, there is the Shravaka vehicle and the Pratyeka Buddha vehicle. These four paths are referred to as the four vehicles. The first path, the Buddha vehicle, is the teaching on how to attain Buddhahood in this very life. This instruction is clarified in the following Buddhist schools of the four vehicles. The Shingon school, the Dharma or Zen school, the Tendai school, and the Kagon school. In the Shingon school, the doctrine is described as the immediate realization of great enlightenment in the present within the body received from one's parents. And it is taught that one attains the state of Tathagata Mahavarochana. In the Dharma, or Zen school, with the heart of Buddha Shakyamuni, the instruction is, quote, The transmission of the Dharma from mind to mind during the era of Buddha Shakyamuni in the past and of Buddha Maitreya in the future, close quote, meaning that the practitioner is in essence already a Buddha. This instruction is referred to as the doctrine of the realization of Buddhahood in one's present state and does not speak of attaining Buddhahood. This teaching was encompassed in a single verse, which Buddha Shakyamuni entrusted to Venerable Kasyapa after preaching the Nirvana Sutra while departing for Parinirvana. In the Tendai school, it is taught that one should meditate on the concept that worldly passions are themselves enlightenment, samsara itself is Nirvana and that the attainment of Buddhahood is accomplished through the observation of the true nature of one's mind. The eight-year-old dragon girl who speedily realized enlightenment in her present state in the pure Buddha world in the South attests to this. The Kagon school teaches that when one first awakens the heart to enlightenment, one has realized enlightenment. And it also teaches the attainment of Buddhahood in one's present state. These Buddhist schools teach the accomplishment of enlightenment in one's present body and call these teachings the Buddha vehicle. The second path, the Bodhisattva vehicle, is the teaching of the attainment of Buddhahood through innumerable eons of Bodhisattva practices. This is followed by two Buddhist schools the Sanran school and the Hoso school. The Sanran school instructs that one will attain Buddhahood through abiding in the meditation of the formlessness of the middle path, or Madhyamaka, that manifests through the Eightfold Negation, by awakening the four universal vows in the heart, and by practicing the six Bodhisattva perfections for three great innumerable eons. The Hoso school teaches that one will achieve Buddhahood after passage of three great innumerable eons if one abides in the five levels of contemplation on the principles of mind only, or Chitta Matra, awakens the four universal vows, and practices the six Bodhisattva perfections. These teachings are referred to as the Bodhisattva vehicle. The third path, the Pratyeka Buddha vehicle says that one realizes the impermanence of all existences by observing the scattering of flowers in the spring and the falling of leaves in the autumn, and that one realizes enlightenment by meditating on the twelve links of dependent origination. This happens in four lifetimes if attainment comes quickly, or in a hundred eons if attainment takes longer. The fourth path, the Shravaka vehicle maintains that first 
in order to remove worldly passions, one contemplates the impurity of one's body. And in order to focus on one's mind, one counts one's own breaths. Ultimately, after meditating on the Four Noble Truths, one reaches the highest stage of a great arhat and passes through the third stage of the four stages of Hinayana Buddhism. This happens in three lifetimes if attainment comes quickly, or in sixty eons if attainment takes longer. These two vehicles, the Pratyeka Buddha vehicle and the Shravaka vehicle, are the paths taught in both the Jojitsu school and the Kusha school. In the case of the Shravaka vehicle, the Buddhist precepts must be strictly observed. A monk is to maintain 250 regulations, and a nun 348 regulations. These are referred to as the five and seven categories of the Hinayana regulations. The Ritsu school includes the regulations for a male and female Buddhist novice, the six requirements for a female novice who aspires to be a nun, and the five fundamental precepts for a male and female lay Buddhist.